Alrighty, Femi Fems. It's a great day, honey buns. Take the love vitamin. Let's take a looky look and let's see what you need to know. I see doors on Divine Feminine. I see doors. Doors are open. I also see the word premonition. A premonition is getting ready to open up a door for you or a premonition that you have had. Do not disregard it. It's going to happen. It's going to manifest. It's going to come to pass. You are going to see the fruits of your labor. Do not get weary in your well-doing. Do not. Whoever needs that message there, do not. It's going to happen. All right. Don't let delays, don't let obstacles, you know, get you just, you know, too discouraged because we all get discouraged in life. It's a part of life. But don't get disappointed because you have nothing to be disappointed about. You are just delayed maybe off timing but this is going to be divine timing in some of your life whatever this is you have already seen it you already know it so do not if god showed you something take him at it if he told you something take him at it he's not going to tell you something and lie those are humans god he has not lied to you and he has not forgotten all right what do your divine feminine need to know? I see those doors. They're swinging back and forth. All right. Could be someone opening doors for you. Goddess of compassion. Self-criticism is diminishing your sense of work. See here, something is trying to get in your mind and make you feel like something is not going to happen. It could be you self-sabotaging or it could be energies around you. Someone trying to make you think, oh, you still think that's going to happen? Or you still think it's going on, um, that person's going to do this? Or you still believe, you still going to do that business? Mm. Oh, okay. I mean, if you say so, I mean, you say that's what the Lord showed you. Well, it's been about what, two years now, three years. Okay. 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 Somebody, you got, you have a negative Nancy in your ears, but you see all this purple and this, uh, towel, not towel. My little cover here is confirmation. There's something that you've already seen. You've already gotten a download. You've already been made aware of something. You know it. You've seen it. It just hasn't happened. You could have had deja vu five, ten years ago, but it's going to come to pass. Now, here it is, angel of communication. Communicate clearly. Don't be afraid to tell it like it is. So, first of all, some of y'all put people in your place. Mind, tell them to mind your business. Mind your business. What you got going on concerns them not at all you have a lot of purple around you you need to be um real sure about who you open up to because your awareness you're, you're very much aware of what's going on in your life but it's almost like some of you all may have a negative nancy trying to dot trying to drop the spirit of doubt in you so don't let that spirit get dropped in you that's a seed of doubt now here it is goddess of justice what seems as an unjust is actually a blessing so this is a blessing in disguise of your life whatever it is or whoever it involves or entails just do not do not get to the place to where you start saying i doubt it's going to happen it's never going to happen allow it allow yourself to say god i thank you whenever it's meant for me to have this it's going to happen i thank you in advance and i'm going on keep it pushing because these doors are going to open and when one door open for some of you all it's going to be is it called adjacent doors or like two doors open up you're going to have two major doors open up in your life all right holy spirit what's this right here what do they need to know what do they need to know yep the page of pentacles um, the nine of cups. So you're going to get your wishes fulfilled. Things are going to manifest. You got to keep praying though. Now you don't have to pray to where you're being aggy and aggravating God. You don't have to keep praying a prayer of request. You need, you, you need to change your prayer format. You need to pray a prayer of thanksgiving. The eight of pentacles. So you've been working on something and see there has been some delays. Now, some of you all, this is something where you're having to borrow money or, you know, you don't have all the funds. You need to go ahead and get that done. Go ahead and take the loan out. Go ahead and ask that family member, that friend, can you borrow it? Because you could be running behind time because of what you need financially. But bad al. Bad al. Did you see what I said? I said tad al. Bad al. Boop, boop. There it is. Six to one. Your ass is going to be moving right the hell along. So I don't want to hear no complainings. See right here, you have something or someone trying to block you, trying to distract you. Now, somebody here is somebody religious or spiritual in your life who's causing delays big time. 
Let me see who the ham sandwich this is. Show me this uh, hair font here. What is this person doing? The Two of Pentacles and the World card. There's somebody online trying to cause you havoc. Somebody's trying to get your attention. They're going to my daughter. And the attention, that's a confirmation. My baby just texted me. The Page of Pentacles, a message. You're going to get the message. You're going to get the response. You're going to get the loan. I feel like for some of you all here, a person trying to block you. I don't know if this is a loan to purchase something or just to, to uh, it could be a big purchase for some of you all. Others of you all, it's like minor things you're trying to get done. You're trying to get something established with the page of pentacles. It's in the baby phases, but it's going to happen. So somebody's on the internet trying to distract you. Be mindful of trolls. Let me say it number one. But it's like it's been a delay around something. So somebody is behind the scenes. Some of you all, this is physically going on. Others of you all. It's spiritually going on. It's spiritual warfare in the baby phases to distract you, to get you caught up watching something online all the time, or be careful of what you're debating about. Um, it's, I say this, especially if you are not a paid influencer, don't be on here debating how we be up here debating. Don't let people know that, you know, that they, that they can be more valuable, excuse me, that they can take your value or your worth away. So don't be up here arguing with these trolls because they're not worth it. But, um... You're being distracted or a person is trying to send distractions towards you intentionally. Yep. This is Knight of Wands. This is somebody who want to sleep with you. Yep. Or if this is not a Knight of Wands, for so some of y'all, you got a player trying to distract you so that you don't move forward or get ahead of them. Others of you all, you have a person that sees the journey and the level of dedication that you have. And they're trying to stop you. But here come the Eight of Pentacles again. You about to rise. So this is mastery with the Eight of Pentacles. Damn, but somebody is really trying to kill or steal your joy. Somebody is a true devil in your life. But it's hands, they invisible hands that they have. And it's like a person. Now, this, this could be someone trying to get you to, you know, respond to what they're saying. Respond to what they're doing. Or get you caught up going back and forth with something. But something is meant to take you off of the promise that you see. The promise that you saw. The promise that you heard. Some sort of deja vu. Some sort of premonition. It's something um, that's inside of you. Others of you all, people are trying to unlock you spiritually. They're trying to intentionally troll your life. Saying things to get you to regurgitate something them or response to give them some sort of confirmation that their irritation is irritating you now some of you all you need to stay really really focused you're going to have to stay focused because i see some of y'all have some big projects it could be projects at work or projects that you started on your own but you need to understand that what you saw is coming or what what was supposed to happen is happening i do see a whole cycle closing out for you Yeah, these people right here, you got some, you got some dog on trolls, honey. These are people that are truly envious of you. Now, some of you all, there's gonna be a grand move in your life, mm hmm. But you have people strategizing against you. Yeah, you also have, you like I said, if you haven't watched one of those videos I talked about, it monitoring spirits, um, monitoring someone is trying to monitor you monitor you and manipulate you but it's only because they, they see you're at a different level of focus it's almost like you're unbothered and they know that you're focused on your work you're getting something done you're investing in yourself you're definitely on a journey you definitely have healed you moved to a peaceful place you've walked away and abandoned some people they're bothered so they're doing, it's like a different tactic, a different method. They're saying, these could be subliminal shots I'm hearing, subliminal shots people are throwing at you or saying things that they hope that will fall on your ears. So someone here is trying to infect you with some sort of energy to make you, like I said, take in that seed of doubt, that seed of worryation, that seed of betrayal. It's almost like somebody is constantly antagonizing you. My God. But it's, it's a major distraction to what you're doing. Others of you all, be careful how much you're sharing your business because people are trying to see if you're trying to get loans, if you're trying to, you know, make big and boss moves. I hear interest rate. This could be someone intentionally trying to uh, you give you a higher interest rate than what you're supposed to have. The seven of swords, shysty people. You got shysty people around you. They can't touch you. But, so the best they can do is send messages towards you 
this, these are trolls. Some of y'all got some trolls. You don't have to be an influencer to have trolls. Just people are trolling your life. But they see. They see your level of focus and determination. And they don't like that you're disciplined. All right. Um, the Holy Spirit wants me to say again, be sure that you stay focused on some sort of vision that you saw, some sort of premonition or deja vu you had, because indefinitely it's going to come to pass. There was some delays, but these doors are going to open. Some of you all have had some delays around some sort of, uh, I don't know, this, this could be health as well. Something getting better, but... Somebody here is definitely going to be healing. I don't know. I don't know if this was. A, I don't know if this was a surgery that you had, but it, it's definitely going to get better. Others of you all, something that you applied for, you've been getting like told no. Somebody is behind the scenes giving you a no, like deny that person. So some of y'all that are in like these corporate worlds or societies and things like that, you're being blackballed so that you cannot get some sort of loan, so that you cannot move forward. All right, close this out. Not right stillness see a person is trying to keep you still but your thing is to be still and know that god is god the universe is working on your behalf so you don't have to you know it's like the, the universe is telling you i'm conspiring with you you don't need to be studying these fools over here these some fools they confuse they're delusional they all are about mess it's like people are trying to keep you in mess you no know, you you keep trying to move forward but somebody's trying to bring you right back into some mess it's because you're at a very confident place a very uh blessed place i i even hear that word surprise surprise and you're getting ready to get a surprise for your life purification you purified yourself for some things that some people could be a situation but it's like someone here is trying to make your life exceptionally hard so it's like people are calling in favors hey did so-and-so come and apply for a loan did they need a car or something are they buying a house are they getting an apartment Oh, you should deny them. Somebody here has higher helpers. Yep. Adventurous. There's going to be an adventurous uh, start for you. And I told you, it's going to bring you much happiness. Trust this process. Trust the process and know that a delay is not a deny. Op the doors are opening. When God opened a door, can't nobody close them. And when he closed the door, can't nobody open them. So these the, these obstacles that are occurring in your life, they are meant to make you better. But they are also meant to make you more powerful. They were meant to make you more confident. And they were meant to make you believe in who you are and who God is inside of you. I feel like God is also constantly showing a person who he is in in their life and other people around them don't believe that you belong to God because people are envious and jealous. They can't do what you do. Tough, tough. Get the hell over it. It was made for you. Don't, don't, and you ain't got to explain nothing. You ain't got to explain a God darn thing and no God darn body. They can kick rocks and drop with their socks off. Peace and blessings. Great day. We're done with that.